first, fast, accurate. With Jennifer Copeland and Rick Schutt, you're watching WSBT Channel 22 News at 6. New information at 6 on a developing story about this Concord High School assistant soccer coach. 27-year-old Emmy Gibson is accused of felony child seduction. Prosecutors claim she had an inappropriate relationship with a 17-year-old student. WSBT's Zach Crenshaw has been working on this story all afternoon. He's live at Concord High School with the latest. Zach? Probable cause document, documents indicate that the relationship was with a student who was involved with a soccer program here at Concord High School. Parents contacted authorities back in August once their daughter admitted that she was sneaking out of the house to be with Gibson. I talked, or police interviewed the girl who admitted that on numerous occasions she would either sneak out of the house and Gibson would pick her up, or Gibson would sneak into her house and they would lie in bed together kissing and touching. The girl told police Gibson was concerned about getting into trouble, so they had not yet engaged in sexual conduct and they were allegedly waiting until the girl turned 18. Now I talked with several people tonight who didn't want to go on camera, but said they knew Gibson and that she's a nice person who would not harm anyone or abuse her power as coach. I talked to other people who said that no coach should have a relationship with a player, particularly a teen, who are vulnerable and look up to people in a position of power. Uh, Concord Superintendent Wayne Stubbs told us in a statement, the corporation's goal is to provide students with a safe environment in which to grow and learn, including extracurricular activities. He says all employees are expected to conduct themselves lawfully and appropriately when interacting with students and parents. Now, I just checked with police a few minutes ago, and they told me that, uh, that she has not been arrested yet, but that there is still a warrant out for arrest. We'll keep you updated on this story and bring you the latest information coming up tonight at 11. Reporting in Elkhart County, Zach Crenshaw, WSBT Channel 22 News.